Hi everyone and welcome to Smoke and Wood, one of Bath's only ancient woodlands. So today we're doing coppicing. Um, coppicing is when you cut a tree down to the ground, um, in this case it's hazel, um, and you allow it to regrow. Um, so we use the wood for um, things like um, hedge laying stakes, you can also use them for bean poles, um, pea sticks, um, and uh, lots of other things. Um, so coppicing involves, um, as I said, cutting a tree down to the base and allowing it to regrow. Um, here what we've done is divided the wood into eight coops, so eight areas, and we cut a whole coop in one year, and then in the following year we cut the next coop, and we keep going until we come back round to the first coop again. So we're cutting an eight-year-old um, coppice stool. Um, and this allows um, lots of different aged wood around the, around the woodland. So we've had loads of help from our weekday volunteers. You might be able to see some of them in the background. Um, so they've been coming out every week doing some of the cutting. Um, they've also been making these really nice um, uh, teepees over the stools. And this is to protect the stools from browsing deer. Um, we've also had lots of children from Whitcomb Junior School come and help us, um, about 120 children, um, and they did lots of the work like uh, moving the wood into dead wood piles. So coppicing is really good for the woodland because it opens up the canopy and allows lots more light to come to the woodland floor. Um, this allows more flora to grow, which in turn encourages more uh, things like butterflies, um, and you also have uh, small mammals and things um, in this environment.